What's going on, Turbros? Bros? Welcome to a little tip video on Showtime. I'm gonna show you guys how I do well on this map, and uh, you know this is pretty much catering to my play style. Uh, I'm a stealthy flank, <laughs> stealthy flank uh, player. So what I do is I go to my right, I find a corner, pick people off as they run through the middle of the map because you're gonna notice when the game starts, a lot of shit pops off. You know what I mean? A lot of stuff hits the fan really quick. So if you slow your roll, you uh, be chill, stay in the corner at the beginning of the game, you're going to be fine. Just pick people off, pick people off, especially if your mission is to get a chem, if you're trying to get a high kill streaks. And then once the gates open, you get your ass in the now, go into the gate right now, just as I did and pre aim down the freaking corners. Why pre aim down corners? Because dude, the spawns are very unpredictable. They can spawn behind you. They can spawn next to you on top of your damn head and you wouldn't even know so that's why it's really important to pre-aim all the time so now what I'm doing right now is I'm also sound horn if you don't use uh, amplify you better start using that because it'll save you a lot of deaths because uh, when people have dead sounds on it's really hard to predict their movement so with amplify it actually does help a little bit you can still kind of hear them faintly even if they're wearing even if they're wearing dead sounds so Another thing is uh, the class setup I'm using is a, a chem class setup or to go high streaks on. If you're interested in that, I did have a video on it. It's my honey boo boo class setup. Link down below if you're interested in that. Otherwise, use whatever gun you're comfortable with. Use what you want. So stick to the outside of the map. That's what I'm doing right now. And you don't necessarily have to stay in this area that I'm at. The only reason why I'm staying in this area right now at this very moment in time is because I'm playing uh, what the game is giving me right now and right now um, I know that the enemies are gonna come from right there You know how I know that it's because I'm looking at my mini map look at where my teammates are at They're all to the right of me. So that must mean that the enemies are to the left You know, it's Call of Duty logic and look at me. I'm getting hit. I'm not uh, You know taking any chances here So I get out of the way and I try to recover myself, which I do so I'm sound whoring there I know there's people to my right because again look at my mini map I know that my my teammates are to my left so that means that there's enemies Enemies to the right you know you guys got to really pay attention to the minimap the minimap is gonna be your best friend uh, this is how you're gonna know what's going on in the game and look at me like if if you're out of ammo like I am you got to pick up a damn weapon especially if you're trying to go for a chem this is very important you're gonna need that weapon to go on a high streak so basically what I'm doing I'm just picking off people just running down through the middle you know it's pretty easy I mean a lot of people you know usually think like oh damn I'm never gonna get a chem on showtime because you know of all it's so cluster fuckish and all that stuff but no it's very possible you just gotta slow your roll you gotta try and uh, you know survey the situation take what the game is giving you and look at me right now I'm uh, pretty much doing the same thing I'm taking what the game is giving me uh, there's a lot of enemies in front of me look at me I'm playing passive aggressive being passive aggressive aggressive is important it means being aggressive but at the same time being passive so uh, you saw me just sit in a corner real quick to recover you have to do that I think some bullshit happens right here yeah that's what happens I had a dead eye didn't kill him I don't know what happened but you know this game is some BS and that you know you're likely to encounter that but we're looking pretty good right now we're 13 and 1 and I'm just gonna go back to my little strategy do the same thing I'm gonna flank the enemy I'm gonna stay away from my teammates because that way I'm gonna run into the enemy a, a lot more so I get this guy this time around and uh, I'm pretty much like in no man's land right here and uh, see that guy he just spawned right there he panic knifed me but it's all good so I'm gonna do the same exact thing I'm going to wherever my teammates are not that is the key to getting more kills than anyone else on your team you gotta be able to flank know how to flank use a silencer silencer is very important use dead silence you gotta be stealthy this is my playstyle, man this is how I play so um, you know uh, because I think it's really important to stay stealthy if you're trying to get a lot of kills so and now what I'm doing is that I'm avoiding the sentry gun see look how I ended up on this side of the map look I'm about to get a kill here and then to my right boom just flanked again and uh, I'm gonna get out of here because they're gonna start spawning here as you can see they spawned right next to me every time you kill uh, an enemy and there's no teammates around you you have to be alert because they could be spawning right next to you just like that right there so here I go again I'm avoiding my teammates I cannot stress this enough man use your damn mini map that's like the most important thing you can do um, it's the most underrated overlooked thing and uh, always pre-aim down every corner that's the most important thing um, what else sound horror if you, you haven't used amplify before it will help you a lot paired with dead silence makes a really good combo 
and uh, I think the game's about to come to an end here, but uh, like I said, dude, it's pretty simple, man. You could drop a chem this way. If you guys are interested in seeing me drop a chem on this map, I'll leave a link down below to that video as well. Um, and that crate, I I think I got a hit marker in there. You could also shoot that crate if you guys didn't know, if, some, if you know an enemy's in there. But anyways, guys, I hope, uh, you know, these tips helped you out. I know a lot of YouTubers probably told you the same shit, but, you know, some of you guys want to hear my, you know, uh, my kind of tips, my style. But anyways, I hope you all found this helpful. Please like the video if you found it enjoyable, and uh, I'll see you on my time, bros, in the next video. <laughs>